On this International Women's Day, we celebrate how women have made their mark on the arts in Providence. The Providence Art Club was founded in 1880 by pioneering women who persevered during a time and field dominated by men. Here to share the history and detail about the new exhibit, Making Her Mark, is co-curator and owner of the Bird Gallery, Kathy Bird. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks so much for being here. Absolutely. This is a very important day and an important exhibit, but before we get to the exhibit that is um, on display now at Providence Art Gallery, let's, or excuse me, Providence Art Club, let's talk about the club. It's sure. the third oldest running art club I was reading, but it was the first one to do what? Well, it's the first um, actually American art club to include women as mm -hmm. their founders and also um, as equal members. No other art clubs um, in the country were letting women exhibit or show. And so it's, it's a fabulous tribute to the Providence Art Club, but also mm -hmm. to the city of Providence as a progressive cultural center. This year marks the 30th anniversary of uh, Women's History Month. Sure. And I think it's so important that we go see an exhibit like Making Her Mark. Tell us about it. Yes, it's really a tribute to um, women artists who really um, made tremendous advances um, mm -hmm. in terms of the arts field for professional artists. And so it, there's over 40 pieces in the exhibit. Wow. Uh, they span mostly from the time period of 1880. And they deal with professional artists, educational um, artists, as well as just art makers. Who are a few of the artists that are displayed right well, now? Well, one of our most prominent artists is Rosa Peckham, and she was one of the founders of the Art Club. Mm -hmm. She was 38 at the founding of the Art Club and a very important uh, member of the executive board. So she not only just was let on to the Providence Art Club, but she was really the person who helped run the Art Club also at the same time. Mm -hmm. Now, when we go to an exhibit like this during any point of the year, because there are many of them, I always like to spend at least a significant amount of time at each yeah, piece. You want to take them in, you want to appreciate what they are. I'm sure there's a description of what absolutely. they've painted or created on the side. Yeah. Um, you know, to put this exhibit together, uh, my co-career writer and I, Nancy Grinnell, I mean, it took us a year. I mean, we had wow. to go through storage units, um, attics, basements, then we had to get paintings that were restored. Mm -hmm. um, there are six different uh, museums and historical societies that are involved, 13 different individual individuals. So when you assemble a collection like that, it, you do have to savor it and take the time. Mm -hmm. So um, we invite people to come. It's free. It's open from 12 to 4. Great. Every day we have daily dialogues. We have a symposium. Um, but it's we just recommend that you advance um, register for it so you can make sure you mm -hmm. get to spend 45 minutes or an hour going through it. I like that. Yeah, you make a reservation so yeah. that way there is a limited amount of people allowed at a certain time because like you said, you don't want to feel rushed. You don't want to feel like you're trying to peek over someone's shoulder and yeah. appreciate the artwork. Absolutely. And then in addition to the uh, exhibit of paintings, we have a complimentary exhibit, um, which is an archival exhibit, so that if it, you get backed up a bit, you can always go to the archival exhibit and find out more about the documents in the history of the club. Beautiful. Great. And before we let you go, after this exhibit, there's always new exhibits on display, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. Um, so for Women's History Month, what we are doing is the historic is in March. Mm -hmm. In April, we have a fabulous contemporary show curated by Katie Watt of the National Museum of Women in the Arts. Uh, there were a thousand applicants. There's going to be 60 women on display for April. It sounds great. Lots yes. to look forward to. Thank you so much for Thank coming you. in and making her mark. Uh, are taking place now is taking place now through March 30th. So check it out.